Good morning, everybody. We've been doing some chronograph work. As you can see, we got a chronograph in front of us. We've been doing a 300 blackout. We've been averaging around 1,700 feet per second, running some 125 grain stuff. This is out of the CAW uppers and lowers. We're running a Liberty Freedom 308 can. We've been running on the SBR, and we've been, like I said, getting around 1,700 feet per second. This is a 16-inch. Uh, using a black coal weaponry barrel, that's what we use on all of our target guns, and we're using a uh, freedom suppressor. And what we've been running is 125 grains we've loaded, but we've also been running some Remington 125. Uh, this right here is just the 115 stuff we're running. Yep. This is Remington 115 grain. If you can zoom in on it or not, probably not here. Lights washing it out, but it's 115 grain. Go ahead and run some rounds and see if we can get some data here. Twenty-three sixteen. Twenty-three sixteen. Been doing some data, trying to get an accurate representation off factory and ammo we've been loading. This uh, is a hundred and twenty-five grain. This Spitzer. one's a. Spitzer. This is a one twenty-five grain Spitzer. They're a Freedom. Twenty-one sixty-one is what that one shows. Gives customers an idea. This is a. 125 grain, boat tail hollow point. 2057. This is a factory load, 125 grain, boat tail hollow point. And that is a 2252. These are all at 16, this is a 16-inch barrel again. This is 168 grain. That was a, the 1814. 1814. And that was a, um, that 168 was a load that we loaded. It was not a factory load, correct? Correct. So we ran some Remington. Um, this is a Remington. This, that was at a Remington Premier Match you ran, correct? Correct. On the 125. It was a... Uh, 2,252 feet per second on a 16 inch. How, how fast again? 2,252 feet per second. That was 16 inch? Yep. So guys, go back and look at these, get an idea. We wanted to run some testing. Like I said, this is a CAW upper and a lower with a black coal weaponry uh, 300 blackout barrel. It's a three groove polygon rifling that we, we actually have them custom make for us. Really good rifles, or really good barrels rather, really good rifles of course. And a one and eight and a half twist is what we're running. We run a one and eight and a half twist. Where's the, uh, where's the upper for the uh, nine and a half? This is a nine and a half inch upper. As you can see the, see the difference between the two. And we were averaging, you know, 2200 and some change. 16 inch and averaging what was we averaging around Probably around 17 around 17 was some of the loads we were loading but out of the 115 grain on the nine and a half we had some pushing around 2000 and some change right yep 2136 feet per second 2136 there you go guys thanks for watching we'll run some more uh videos with some different stuff we'll give people an idea what this 300 blackout was thank you